So you want to step back in time with your bathroom fixtures? This beautiful porcelain sink was actually found in an old movie theater in Boston. It's now being sold here at Restoration Resources in Boston South End. Bill Raymer is here to show me the variety of vintage sinks. Mm -hmm. But why would people want to go in this direction as opposed to all the modern technology we have today? Well, these are certainly uh, fully functional. What most people want when they buy the antique bath stuff is because they have an antique house and they want to totally restore it. So as opposed to buying the new stuff, which might look okay, they want the real stuff. This is the real deal. Yeah, Pedestal exactly. sinks. You have some of the original hardware up here that I see as well. And then we have another type of sink here, which is the marble top. And this one has the original old uh, china bowl. And if you really want to do the whole thing over, you know, not just the uh, tub, toilet, and sink, you can get into the accessories, which are the towel bars like this here. This is a soap holder, a uh, cup holder, a porcelain toothbrush holder. So that was that was for a home where there was one bathroom. <laughs> one bathroom, right. Everyone, a lot of kids. Everyone stuck their brush in the sink. And you could sell these. I mean, that would be kind of fun just to have. In, I, you know, I like tchotchkes like right. these. Right. You could so. use this again. The other thing we have, too, are the uh, medicine cabinets. So we have built-in medicine cabinets. Oh, yeah, like these. Right? Would people refinish these, or do they like to keep them? Generally, they would uh, strip these and get them down to the bare wood and then either stain them or repaint them. I love these old vintage tubs. Now, is this porcelain or is this? Uh, this is vitreous china. There's two types of tubs. There's the cast iron ones and then what's called vitreous china, which is like uh, pottery. Uh, to, oh to my simplify gosh. It. Yeah. It's gorgeous. What, these, what year would this be? What would this this one is about, about 1910 and these were generally put into the, the more expensive homes of the day. Bill, would you buy one of these or do you probably have a modern jacuzzi at home, don't you? Uh, actually, I do. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyway, we're soaking up the ambiance here at Restoration Resources.